I'm not saying she's ditzy, but we'll Rory like that in the real world? I'm thinking not. Tonight on Big Brother, Rory and Rihanna. Is she really going out with him? In the real world, those two people might not even find each other attractive. He said to like this. Yeah. <laughs> I think he likes this new girl called Rihanna. Oh. Nobby's commie confession. The last couple of weeks, I've started to stir a bit of crap. I get bored. And crazy things to do on a rainy day. <laughs> Sounds like a house full of bloody orangutans. Drizzling rain has confined most of the housemates to indoors, which suits the house's most talked about couple. Bed buddies Rory and Rihanna are happy to have a lazy afternoon doing nothing. That's a loud one in my ear. <gasps> I actually didn't think I'd see anything like this in the house, but... Really? No. In the real world, those two people might not even find each other, mm. you know, attractive or, you know, that they've got much in common. Mm. But when you, that's all you got... I sort of thought, like, Rory, she's a bit... I'm not saying she's ditzy, but she's, um... How can I explain it? She doesn't sort of know much about cooking or cleaning or... Or she things just kind like of sits that. around. Yeah, she doesn't, like, even, she didn't even know. Like, like last night she said she'd never cooked an egg. You know, I think, yeah, folks that's don't want women like that who've never cooked an egg. Yeah, just like some of those conversations with her, I'm thinking, well, you know, will Rory like that in the real world? Yeah. I'm thinking not. I'd probably like to come home to a home-cooked meal. Oh, green intruders in here changed a lot, I reckon. Yeah. I don't... Mm. I don't know. I don't know if I like this, these intruders. These intruders, yeah. Like, Terence has just been annoying. And the other two have just fitted in. Yeah. How are you feeling about being nominated this week? My, the nature of me and coming in here obviously is a bit of an ir irritating person. Um, I was pretty much expecting to be up for nomination. Do you think your sense of humour has been an advantage or a disadvantage with your fellow housemates? Um, I'm thinking it's probably been a disadvantage, but hopefully an advantage... Um, to staying in the house from a public perception. Because it's not bad humour, big brother. It's pretty funny. I'll ask, I'm going to ask Cherry a question. Would you be attracted to someone like Rihanna? No, I don't, I don't really get along with her. I just don't, well, to me, like personally, I don't I think she's too fake, sort of like, I don't know. I was, I was betting that. Her and Rory, like, they look pretty hot together and that. But she doesn't even, she can't even cook an egg. I just don't, I, just, I, don't, reckon she, I don't reckon she's that hot. She'd freak like, out. Without all the makeup, nothing real special. These are your It's not as I'm gonna like cut Rory's lunch or anything. No, it's just, just interesting thing. how different fellas think about things. I just, yeah, not a fan of her really. I figured that you would think like that. <laughs> Rory, he's. He's so protective of her now. Yeah, he's like, he sits with her like this. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to try and make him jealous, like, kiss Rihanna on the cheek when she does stuff. Like <laughs> <laughs> Spin out my <like> dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we've got green and white and brown. Yeah. We can have peas and chickpeas. Can't. We've got some blonde in it. I just had a can yeah. of chickpeas. <laughs> when I open it, it smells like cat food. Let's just try baking them. Yeah. Just cause I'm up with that. they yeah. taste like feet now, Thank so you. they can't get any. They taste like what? 
feet. I don't even eat feet. I've never tasted feet. I wouldn't know. I love it when people do that when you say that they taste like something and they're like, oh, I think you've tried it. You're like, can you think of anything better to say? What do you mean? You're talking to me about... Oh, so you think I shouldn't have said that, Bianca? No, you're like the fourth person today that said, have you tasted us? Have you tasted feet? <laughs> There's a, a, a one-armed person who is um, a fisherman and uh, a guy comes up to him and says, how do you fish? And he says, well, it's really easy. I just fish like anyone else. He says, but how do you bait the hooks? He says, well, what I do is I, I get the, the bait and I stick it in my mouth and I get the hook and I hook it in like that we not doing my lips, I chuck it out and I throw the line out like that and then I get it in here and I pull and do this, you know, wind and pull and wind and pull in like so. Wait, Whenever it... I have a dream about this certain person, you can only... squeeze my pimples. No. no. Ah. You have a pimply back? No, don't. Yeah, I do. Yuck. Not I do. Really. And a pimply chest too. I have one right Come here. Yeah, I want to see the extent this of it. Like a and the guy says, have you ever caught any really, you know, big fish? And uh, he says, oh, yeah, I have. He said, well, what's the biggest fish you've caught? He says, oh, I think it was about that big. Coming up. Trouble brewing for Terry and Bianca. Bianca's been very standoffish with me lately and saying really, really sarcastic things. For this week's task, housemates have to run a hair salon. They're on call 24 hours to give or get a hairstyle. They'll not only be judged on the cut, but their idle chit chat as well. So, how's the family and kids? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's great. Yeah, she's going well. Um, <clears throat> working as a gym instructor. <laughs> she's benching 200 these days. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know, working as like a sort of reggae artist wasn't really working for me. <laughs> so, you're gonna... so, I'm going for the change of hairstyle. I'm going to get more into the sort of like the Elvis. <laughs> I think that'll really work for you. <laughs> I don't know how this is going to work. <laughs> this bit's a bit too long in my opinion. <laughs> that wasn't quite the length I was hoping for. <laughs> Look how long that is. Let <laughs> 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 just trim that bit up for you. <laughs> Alice. Yep. How do you feel about being up for nomination again? Um, I'm, not, I'm not as stressed as I was last week about being up again. Um, to be nominated again, you know that enough people have put you up there that they're, they're not completely comfortable with you as a person, like with me as a person. So that's always going to be the, the bit that is hard to stomach and I don't think I'll ever get used to that if I'm lucky enough to be here next time and then I go up on the Monday again. You know, the, the reality that you've still got enough people not caring or not wanting you to be in their Big Brother world hits me hard. Do you feel you have to be wary of your fellow housemates as you're talking to them? I'm wary of how Nobby and Ben see me. Um, you know, I'm, I'm really gutted that, especially Nobby, who I really thought I really liked and I can't help but not really like him anymore and that's hard. I've never really, you know, truly disliked someone and I don't truly dislike him but he is someone that I am actively avoiding just because I'm, you know, there's an intimidation factor now as well and I don't, I don't want that. I wouldn't want that in the real world and I'm... I'm sad that he, you know, he's sceptical about my personality. <laughs> I look like a rabbi. I look like a rabbi. You've made me look like a rabbi. You were trying to make me look like a rabbi. This is amazing. You had the audacity to give me a rabbi haircut when I asked for Elvis. <laughs> I was going to say to you before, I found, I find Bianca has been very standoffish towards me lately. Towards you? Mm. Mm. And saying really sarcastic things to me. Mm. Like out there, she said something about, ooh, it tastes like feet. I said to her, what do feet taste like? She says, oh, you think you could th you think of something original to say? I don't think she, she meant it in a... I do. ...derogatory way, though, I do. Tess. 
What are you guys chatting about? Taz was just saying, you know, that she's... I said, I've just noticed Bianca's been very standoffish with me lately and saying really, really sarcastic things. Have you noticed it? Did you um, hear in the kitchen? No, I haven't noticed it, but oh, man. That's, that's, Renee said that as well about, you know, she's yeah. worried she's becoming one of the boys. Um, she said, well... It's she is in a very bad mood today with Staples. She might have said a few comments that if you asked her, she'd be like, oh, Tez, I do not mean to say it like that. Yeah, I, don't I know think you can never make excuses like that, and mm. you can't say, "Oh, well, that's not an excuse because she's 18 oh, so that, and stuff." Over the past few days, and the sarcastic comments about putting the eggs in the in the um, meatloaf. If I could have done it my way, yeah, I didn't. I heard that. Yeah, you heard that one, and I just I've been waiting for her to say that. But I just think know. in here, little things like that, like kind of blow up out of proportion. Oh, that's yeah. why I haven't said anything. After a day of being kept indoors by the constant rain. Boredom is starting to drive everyone stir crazy. Hey, Bridget. Ma. Bridget. Full of bloody orangutans. After the break, Travis tries a chest wax. One, two. <laughs> <laughs> the rain has forced the housemates indoors for the entire day. Pull my hair. That's bad enough but worse for combi man Nobby, whose only refuge is his van. Big brother. Nobby, how are you finding being head of the house? Um, it's fine. It's not that big a deal, I don't think, being head of the house. I mean, I'm, I just told them they can pretty much do whatever they want anyway. But, yeah, but I don't know. It's getting tougher each week for me, though, Big Brother. The weather's getting worse and, you know, and I've lost, I think I've lost a lot of people that um, uh, were very, you know, hung out with me a lot. So I think the last couple of weeks I've started to stir a bit of crap to just, just, it's not, it's not even playing the game or anything like that because it puts me in a worse position. But when you're locked in, a, especially just the backyard, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, you run out for, to things to do and just do things for your own amusement. I mean, that does sound bad and kind of evil, but I get bored. Don't look at it as all the housemates don't like. Of course not. Hey, I don't think that Just at all. look at it. I'm a 51-year-old man who's gone through bitter disappointments in his life, highs, lows, all that mm. sort of stuff. That's exactly what I said. This is nothing. This isn't going to kill you. This is what, nothing yeah, for exactly. me, mate. What we've been through in our life, this is nothing compared yeah, to what this we've is been just... through. Yeah. Yeah, I know, but it can still get quite... Oh. It can, it can it get can, quite daunting yeah. because of the no. intensity of the situation. Well, the first week I was here, I felt like I was going to die. Yeah, oh, my God, I thought I was going to die. Uh. I was pretty certain I'll get nominated this week, but um, I'm pretty sure I'll just get... Um, I'll be up there pretty much every week from now on. You know, I'm not, like, the overly mo most nicest guy. I don't know. I just feel I'm a fairly easy target to get nominated for from now on. And I'm not sucking or whinging to you. I'm, it's just something I've accepted. Say the words, Irish wristwatch. Irish wristwatch. Fast, ten times. Irish wristwatch, fast, ten times. No. <laughs> With you and Terence, there's a bit of love in the air. Oh, yeah. bullshizer. <laughs> bullshizer, Bolson. Bullshizer, Hazen, Hazen. <laughs> that would never be happening, I'm afraid. Oh, Terry! There's me bubble all right in my brain. We've started to, I think, appreciate Terry more once the test <laughs> is coming. We appreciate the test. He's good, he's all right in small yeah. smidgens. I think he's smidgens. good as an intruder. Mm. Yeah, he's good as an intruder. Because yeah. he's different. Mm. And he's weird. He's a freak. <laughs> Say
say Irish wristwatch, Irish wristwatch, Irish wristwatch, Irish wristwatch, Irish wristwatch. Irish wristwatch, Irish wristwatch, Irish rich wast, Irish rich wast, Irish rich witch, Irish clock, Irish timepiece, Irish sundial, Irish grandfather clock. I don't know how a woman could live with a bloke like that. That's yeah. stabbing him to death. <laughs> he's, he's not, he's not, he's a good bloke though. Like, yeah, I know, but it would drive him There's a lot worse blokes out there. He's one of those guys you don't want to bump into in the street. Yeah, you never get away from him. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Terrence, we're going to wax my nipples. On a rainy day when people are looking for things to do, Travis has asked his fellow housemates to wax his chest. <laughs> this is really good. Yeah. Nothing goes besides my nipples. No, just yeah. nipples. Yeah. Okay. All right, Travis. Oh, oh, I think you have to go hard. It needs to be really like warm. My nipple's not going to rip off, is it? No. No. Which way are you going? No, no, go. No, that's this way. Oh. This way? This is going to kill all. Oh. Oh, I'm going to leave it there for a bit, all right, Travis? <laughs> Let it cool. Manscaping, eh? <laughs> Manscaping. That is going to hurt you so down, much. No, you'll oh, be fine. Travis! You got to get it try. really warm so it's, yeah. it's clear. Yeah, we did. It's warm. Oh, clear. Oh, shut up! Oh, 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 it stings! Uh, shut up! <laughs> Leave me on the other one! Hey, Travis! No. Travis, part of your nipples on there. Travis, no, no, yeah, no, no, no. Right, no, it's it's on that bite. No, no, go this way. Maybe you wash it off. Against against the grain. Is it good? Yeah. Ready? Okay. Ready? One. Wait, wait, one, one, two. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 Thanks, Victor. No Thanks, worries, mate. mate. No worries, mate. Anytime. Look, seriously. Big nipples now. You've got to put out more to Big nipples. Next, Nobby and Ben feel the pressure of a house divided. But whoever goes first out of you and I are pretty, much, pretty well stuffed. Now they're Wash and a mullet. What's your name? Gertie Lou. Gertie Lou, sit down. Thanks. Busy day. Oh, stressful. Mm, very. So how's your boyfriend? My boyfriend's fabulous. Oh, good. There's a quick little massage here, love. Oh, divine. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, you must have a scalp condition that's right. <laughs> Your hair is moving. I'm just going to get straight into this. I think I know what I'm doing. That's the confidence you want. I think I know what I'm doing. Oh, golly. There you go. <laughs> Whoa. We can, blend, we can blend it all in. Look at that smile. Look at that. Oh. What? What? Ooh. Baby. Looks all white to me. Oh no, Terence. <laughs> and is that the latest photo of you, man? Yes. Yeah. That's Freddie. <laughs> oh, he... Freddie's in a bit of a pickle good. at the moment. Oh, really? Yeah. I think he likes this new girl called Rhiannon. Oh. So. Have you met her? Freddie's pretty tied up with Rhiannon at the moment. Oh, really? Love what you've done with the midline. It's just hacked in. <laughs> oh, that's great. Yeah. I'll get all this off. Oh. Look at that. Thanks for that. You're and a I'll, legend. And I'll Thanks. see you again I'll soon. See you next week. Thank you. Uh, how did you feel about being put up today? Did it bother you at all? Nah. I was expecting it. And like I said, I honestly do expect to be up every week now. Yeah. What, did you think I'd be stressed out for up in being up in nominations? No, I was just checking. But whoever goes first out of you and I are pretty, much, pretty well stuffed. What? Well, you'd be more stuffed than I would because you can't come inside. But say you left this Sunday. Yeah. Like, I'd be pretty stuffed. 
because I've got well Bianca, Travis, Travis, but he doesn't like me as much anymore. Yeah. And then Rory, who's in love. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe he was. I can't believe he was hugging her. <laughs> yeah. He's such a sleaze. How funny is he? He just smashes it. I think he he, he really likes it. I think. Who is smuggled? Have I? You put stuff on before you go to bed? No. The like cream? No. Maybe it's just because of the smell of not doing anything all day. Yeah, like that lazy smell. <laughs> Super sexy lazy smell. Terence. Hi, big brother. Do you have a quick, short joke that you'd like to tell before you leave? It's Nana's 90th birthday. So the family gather Nana. They, they go to the retirement village to see Nana. And her grandson arrives late. And he comes up and he says, Hi Nana, how's it going? And because she has a very weak voice, she has a notepad. And... Um, oh, hang on, big brother. Yep. Yeah. What, no, sorry. What happens, my apologies. What happens is Nana, they wheel her out under the tree. She goes under the tree and while she's sitting there, she all of a sudden starts to, to fall forward. So they get her and they put her back and they prop a pillow behind her back. And after a little while, she starts to fall to the side, so they grab her and they prop her up and put a pillow here. And a little while later she falls to this side, so they prop her up and put a pillow here. And the grandson comes along and says, he's running late, and he says, hi Nana, how are you going? And she writes him a note, and he reads it, and it says, they won't let me fart. Thank you, Terence. Thank you, big brother. Good night. Tomorrow on Big Brother, is Rory in love with being in love. It's not because he genuinely likes who she is. He likes who she is because she's just a companion. To vote to evict this week's nominated housemates, dial 1902 555 and then for Rihanna at 81, for Terence at 79, for Alice at 72, for Cherry at 80, or text their name to 191010. The long votes cost 55 cents max. 190 votes from Mobiles Extra. Lines close at 10.45 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time this Sunday, the 15th of June. For terms and conditions, go to bigbrother.com.au. Want more Big Brother? You can watch 24-7 on bigbrother.com.au or on your three mobile. This program brought to you from Dreamworld, the home of Big Brother. Big Brother.